Whoa, what is that? Well, well, well. <laughs> Frank, D, what you two have discovered today is what is most commonly referred to as a glory hole. Okay, first of all, first of all, first of all, I've watched this episode a few times, but when I watch it, it's just kind of in the background, you know? I was kind of taking for granted that these are like fresh predators, and this is like an entirely different beast of a show. And keep in mind that I watched and reacted for about 35 minutes to golf cart mat alone and then right after that watch this shit point that i'm trying to get to here with this interjection is i say dog a lot in this video also not as much as golf cart max but yeah dog i was so burned out and i was so dead but you know what the whole point of me showing y'all golf cart mat was to show you glory hole jerry but to be honest i feel like i got a lot more content out of mat i don't know comment below if you give a full full of a fuh oh. But I'm very shook it. I knew that Golf Cart Matt and Glory Hole Jerry were good, but I had no idea how deep this rabbit hole was gonna go. This area of Monroe County seems to be a bit of a hotbed for potential child predators, as the decoys have another guy itching to meet an underage boy. The Viper decoy is talking to a guy named Jerry, who says he is 19 years old. No, he has not given me a location, but he said he's at his uncle's. Oh, he's visiting his uncle in this neighborhood. Yeah. Do we know how far away he is, or we just know he's in the neighborhood? Um, uh, five You ever have a, one of these things where two different guys were in the same neighborhood, essentially? No. I mean, I've never seen it before. In any, oh, I've yeah, never, wait a I've second. What is going on with this neighborhood? It's very close by where they're walking distance. We've had walkers. I wonder if Jerry and Matt know each other. This, I mean, we could see the last one down the street. And rather than him coming to us, he initially wants the 14-year-old boy to come to him. And his reason isn't one that I've heard before. He has a glory hole set up. He wants... In case you don't know, a glory hole is a hole in a wall designed for anonymous sexual encounter. Knowing I'm 14 wants me to come there, walk in, use it, and leave without ever seeing him or knowing him. This is a bad guy. Yes. What yes. do you think the odds are this is the first time he's done this? Slow to none. But there's been a development with Glory Hole Jerry, and it's one that I've seen all too I also love this because Chris himself is nicknaming these guys. Like, it's not the fans coming up. Like, I didn't name Matt Golf Cart Matt. The community of fans did not name Jerry Glory Hole Jerry. Chris has knighted them. Many times before, an admission. It's like Chris is finally in on the joke. It's like he's like having fun with everybody. On some pet bro, I will still come. Just understand. Um, I don't understand. If not, let me know. I'm 47. Wow. So he's gone from 19 <laughs> to 47. Yeah. In the span of this conversation. That predator yeah. math dog. And he just said that that was a, thing, a friend of a family's face. Comes right. handy. So he showed you a picture that was obviously. He's trying to lure people in right. now. Yeah, so this is a little bit more. Right. I mean, this is a predator. Right. Hold on now. 47. Pretending to be 19, sending people's pictures yeah. of his. Right. To lure even younger kids. But it's clear to him that you're 14. Very clear. Yeah. He's really about his glory hole. Well, <laughs> He's really about his glory. Oh, you know Jerry. You know Jerry. Tim, you know, he bought a Corvette during his midlife crisis. But Jerry, he's really about his glory hole. I don't think it's a phase, Marge. I'm looking to get oral and can truly deep throat you and swallow. What, no next nips of BJ's? Psh, amateur hour. This is grooming in real time. Yo, Jerry wants to be the one on the other side. Oh, <laughs> Jerry. Yes. Glory hole Jerry is on his way. If the <laughs> Viper team gets prepared. <laughs> what the fuck are you kidding me? Stop. And I have to make sure all cameras are in place to capture the confrontation and the takedown. And that the Stinghouse looks like someone actually lives here. 
The decoy is in position and ready to meet Jerry at the door. Vehicles off. But also waiting for Jerry is me. Kame. Hey, what's up? What is it? How's it going? Good, what's up? Sorry. Hey, hold on, I forgot my charger real quick. Oh, you're fine. So Sorry. You swear nobody's gonna be coming in. No, <laughs> my mom's at work still. She'll be home after like seven in the morning. As the decoy is literally mid-sentence saying, nobody else is here, Chris Hansen is like, <sighs> So what are you up to tonight? Not much. What's your plan? Meet him. Meeting who? Him. Who is it? Travis. Travis. And what's your name? Jerry. Jerry. Jerry, where did you come from tonight? Oh, way, way, way. The other side of the park. Right in this neighborhood? No, other side of the park. The other side of the park. Yeah. And how did you meet Travis? What do you mean how that meeting? How did you meet him? How did you find Wait him? Wait a second, look at that. Fucking creepo peeking around the corner. That is so fucking silly, dog. I can't. I can't. I'm Ryder. I'm Ryder. And what was the discussion on Ryder? Right. No, Jerry. You need oh. you know, Jerry, know, Jerry, Jerry, Jerry. Jerry tries oh. to make a run. Jerry is on the move. The Viper team doesn't let Hell him no. Him. Hell no. The greatest professional athlete in the world today. Look at this. He's landed for it. I don't believe it. Patricia, get your hands. Patricia, get your hands. I love it. Relax, relax. Relax. Bring your hands. Fumbling for the glasses. Bring your hand back. Alright. Got it. Got it. Jerry, how did Travis say that he was in your conversation? Jerry? 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 Just relax, Jerry. Jerry? I got a bad back, guys. Well, y'all just relax, okay? You can see the scar. Oh, stop, Jerry. Just relax, Jerry. We'll get you set up in a second. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Jerry, this is not the glory hole. Relax. <laughs> this is my I'm gonna set you on your behind. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Suddenly, Jerry says he's in pain. And like many alleged predators, And Jerry says he's in pain. Tries to get sympathy after he's caught. But his diversion is not going to work. My back is killing me. All right, you want to be checked out by, by medical? <sighs> Even I am going to take a seat for this one. What I do here is medical is not going to come here. We're going to take it to them. Okay. So uh, you need to relax. Jerry, uh -oh. Jerry, there's something you need to know. Uh -oh. My back, Jerry. Okay, first of all, this is your 15 minutes in fame, Jerry, so I'm not very wise to spend it this way. Second of all, if you're really in pain to that extent, you will not just go, ah, my back. <laughs> you will be screaming or you will be out. That's it. You're this little bitch ass. Jerry. What? I'm Chris Hansen. What? I don't know who you are. How do you know who I am? Oh. Uh, because well, I've just, uh, I've said I would never do this and I did it anyway. Why did uh, you do it, Jerry? Why? 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 Yeah. Why did you do it, Jerry? Why? Yeah. It seems like your back is the least of your problems right now. Oh my god, my back is killing me. Oh yeah, I forgot my back hurts. Okay, well, that will be addressed in a minute here, but... Why did you think it was okay to have this sort of conversation with somebody who said they were 14? Oh, because I'm stupid. Because I'm stupid. You talk about a glory hole. Wanting the boy to go oh, to your house. Oh god. Oh, my back me. Okay, there's, there's not a lot of sympathy here because of what you were here to do, Jerry. Do you understand that? I understand that. I have had surgery twice on my back, okay? I've had four brain surgeries, Jerry, and that's actually a fact. Okay, like, Jerry, I literally have holes in my brain, and that's a fact, and you don't see me out here doing this shit, dog. So while I was editing, this guy kept reminding me of some cartoon turtle and I couldn't for the life of me place it. I knew that it wasn't Franklin because Franklin doesn't wear glasses, obviously not a ninja turtle. I was like, who the fuck? And then bingo. It's that little turtle ass from the fucking Fox Robin Hood. And my back is hurting now. They're gonna take My back ass. is hurting now. 
But first, I want to know what you were thinking by coming over here to try to... Jerry, first of all, if your back is hurting like that, how the fuck would you ever expect to get down with a younger person? First of all. Second of all, Jerry... Jerry, why? Stupid, I'm telling you. Stupid. What do you do? For a living, Jerry. Um, nothing, I'm... I don't do nothing. Disabled. I'm You're disabled. <laughs> how long have you lived in this area? Oh my god, my god. Jerry. Jerry. Wait. How long have you lived here? Jerry. Five years. Five years. And I've never done this. You've never before. done it before. Ever. You seem five to years and I've been able to work. It, Jerry. I've lived in the pedophile playground for five years. Five years I heard golf cart Matt running his mouth about all the game he's talking. Five years, Chris. Five years. Never once part took. And the one day, the one day. God damn, I'm never listening to golf cart Matt ever again. He said, you just gotta buy little Ricky some cigarettes uh then uh you know i got a really good lead on some tang some boy tang i'm not first so. of all you said oh. first of all you said you're 19 you sent a fake picture whose picture was that of the 19 year old jerry he reminds me of like the um dude it's like the spark notes version of yukon what's his face the guy who uh Pretended to be like an 18 year old and then like had to excuse himself and then he was like yeah But my older friend he'll do a great job of taking your virginity This is what this guy reminds me of except that like he just moved 12 times faster What? What? A picture I got offline Offline, but you said you were not God, I don't know. Comment below. Who has a worse attitude? Golf cart Matt or Gloria Hole Jerry? Uh, comment below. Who would you rather be stuck in a jail cell with? I would just die. I would rather die. Just kill me. You know, I, it's it's an honest issue. God would never ever punish me like that. And God forbid that you ever do something to warrant that kind of penance. That's some sick shit, dog. Imagine, okay, you're stuck in a room with Golf Cart Matt, Glory Hole Jerry, and you're also with... Who's the most annoying predator? I'm wasting time. 19. Oh. Why would you tell somebody you were 19? Because I'm stupid. You're I stupid. Stu what is this? Cause I'm stupid. He's like Victor Ambrosio with the. I'm That's it. You're just stupid. Yes. And what about all this talk about a glory hole and wanting the boy to go to you for sex? You talk about deep throating him that you'd swallow. Yeah, I was stupid. I was really fucking stupid. Jerry swallows. Okay, Jerry. Okay, Jerry. Now what's in it for me, Jerry? <laughs> what do you think would have happened, Jerry, had we not Nothing. been here and a 14-year-old boy had been here? Nothing. I really wanted to see if he was real. That's it. Okay. Well I mean, obviously, Chris, there's no glory hole in this sting house. So I, you know, really don't think Jerry was going to do anything, honestly. Because Jerry's all about his glory hole. It's all, he, Jerry's all about his glory hole. All right. He's not... I was just coming to check out the situation. You saw that when you walked in and you looked very excited. He did. You even asked if anybody else was here. Why would you ask that? Because I'm dumb. Okay, that doesn't wash, Jerry. You're more than dumb. You were here to I'm pray on the time. They're going to take care of that in a minute. I'm hurting, Jerry. I'm hurting. I have a migraine from golf cart Matt. And if you're going to run me around in circles any more than that, motherfucker, come on, Jerry, give me the goods. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Glory Old Jerry is one of my favorite predators in terms of entertainment value. This dude is fucking nuts. Oh. You think you're a oh. How would a 14 year old boy feel after you sexually assaulted them? Thank you, Chris. I wasn't going to do anything. Okay, but that's not what you said in the chat, is it, Jerry? No, it's not. I said that already. Looking for some great head. the same questions. I already said that. Well, explain I it. I f***ed up, okay? I did a stupid thing. I don't need that in my face. Well, you yes, sure you, you do, Jerry. Choice, Jerry. Well, I do have a choice. No, no you don't, no, Jerry. Jerry. Jerry turns away from me and the camera. What's your tattoo of, Jerry? I'm not talking to you anymore. So. Oh. Pouting <clears throat> like a child. Yes. You have nothing else you want to say? No. Chris took the words right out of my mouth. I'm not talking to you anymore. Great. Okay, Jerry, sure. Like, you can keep your mouth shut for longer than, like, two seconds. We know you love the glory hole. All day long, you're just, uh, oh. ready for it. And you want me to believe that this is the first time you've done this? Well, I'm telling you it is, so whatever. Cause this is my United States or whatever! Do you see why I would not believe that? I don't care if you believe it or not. Do you see how this looks? 
<laughs> yeah, I know how it looks. It's really f***ing dumb of me for doing what I did. Really f***ing dumb. And you see why it would be hard for me to believe this is your first time doing it. Well, I don't care if you believe me or not. I'm telling you it is, so... You just woke up today and said, I'm going to try to meet a 14-year-old boy online for sex. No. Yes. Jerry, I'm your lawyer now. I will fight, fight, fight. Please call fight, 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 fight. Fight, fight, fight. Oh, you. Yes, Chris, okay. As stated before, we've been in the pedophile playground neighborhood for five years, okay? This was the first time that Jerry ever even set foot in the perimeters, okay? Uh, off the record, Chris, if you had to listen to Golf Cart Matt go on and on, you have to see if it's real or not because you just want to shut him up. You want to shut him up or get in on the action, Chris. And that's off the record. I wasn't, actually. I was looking for older. Okay, but you... I was looking for older. Found a 14-year-old and you acted upon it, didn't you? Yeah, like an idiot. Okay. Yeah. I you... ate better than that too. Do you have a glory hole in your home? No. Why did you say it? Do though? not because lie, I Jerry. I would have made one, but not for him. Wait, you said you would have made a glory hole for this boy. No, not for the boy. Ah! Wait, you said you would have made a glory hole for this boy. No, not, not for the boy! No, not for the boy! Okay, what well, my favorite bits about all of this is that, first of all, the implication that he was just gonna make a glory hole like that. Okay, you don't, okay, making a good glory, okay, first of all, you don't want to just do a rush job on a glory hole, okay? There's a lot of factors that you have to take into account. You gotta make sure that it's a fair height for everybody involved. You know, you gotta make sure that it's not too jagged. You gotta make sure that it's large enough to accommodate, but but uh, not too large that it will intimidate. And there's all these things that, you, you, you know, that go into making a glory hole, I would imagine. Uh, that's just off the cuff. But someone who's really into glory holes like Jerry is, I'm sh no way he's just going to make a glory hole off the cuff for whenever he finds someone in the glory hole. Uh, moral of the story, Jerry definitely has a glory hole in his house already. He probably has a few. Well, that's what you said, Jerry. That's not what I meant. Sounds like Jerry is starting to get angry. <laughs> Sounds like Jerry's starting to get angry. That was fucking serious. I'm so sorry. Sounds like Jerry's starting to get angry. You're trying to get me all fed up now, and I'm not doing it. Jerry, have you seen my shows before? Yes. 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 What did you think of those shows? How stupid the people were. Did you ever think you'd be on one of those you shows? No, because I'd never wanted to do anything like this before in my life. Why today? Because I'm stupid. I told you. Fucking asshole. Dumb ass decision. You sent a picture of somebody who was 19. And then once you figured out that the 14 year old you thought you were talking to might be open to sex, you say, oh, wait, I'm 47. Is that okay? It sounds like grooming to me, Jerry. No, it wasn't. Well, that what was is it? Tell me, tell me what it is. You're right, Chris and Jerry. That was not grooming, actually. That was like the opposite of grooming. That was like, uh, that was like the, the weakest attempt at grooming. That was like five seconds of, hey, I'm like your age, but actually I'm not. You want to fuck glory hole yet? Nah, I don't know if that's grooming, dog. Malik Washington groomed better. Dude, <laughs> Jerry fucking Kosis <laughs> groomed better than this guy. Yes, I told you I was. I can't believe I'm ranking predators on their grooming skills. Stupid. All right, that's a cop out, Jerry. You're not, you're not getting to the truth here. I'm telling you the truth. I was stupid. I was dumb. And now you're getting arrested. I gotta face it now. Yeah. Nothing I can do about it. What do you think should happen to you, Jerry? I love Jerry. Chris. I didn't do anything to you, anybody, but yes, I was dumb. The crime was committed in the chat. I know that. <laughs> so you know the law, right? Yes. And you broke it. And so it's hard for me to believe. I'm loving this back and forth between his head in the fucking carpet and Chris just like on his little throne. This is like the most, like how? This is like. That had we I not been here. Funny, Doug. It seems like you would have done something. Yeah, can you quit talking because I really don't want to listen to you. I just can you just shut the fuck up, Chris? <laughs> I just want to go down to the jailhouse, call my lawyer, be done with that part. 
I'm tired of listening to you. Disrespect on this man. No, no. Tell me where he is. Let me at him. Let me at him. You're tired of listening to me. Is there anything else you want folks to know about this situation? <laughs> yeah, don't do it. You're stupid if you do. Okay. Jerry, thanks for talking to us. These these guys want to take over from here. Jerry, come on. Let's turn around back on your... Uh, Back on your butt. Roll over, pig. Get up, get up. Roll, yeah. Roll over, pig. He's taken away by the Monroe County Sheriff's Office Viper Task Force. But something happens on the way to the Sheriff's Office Detention Center that shocks even me. Sergeant Mike Predmore fills me in on the detail. He's gross. So you heard from the transport crew and the people at the Sheriff's Department. Yeah, I got a telephone call from Detective Davison that was uh, transporting Jerry to the substation for an interview. And during the ride, uh, Jerry offered up information about our location. And he actually was uh, glad that we're here because there's a lot of people in here that are just like him. Yeah. Really? He did, yeah. So he even brought up wow. the guy that drives the green golf cart that stops and talks to a lot of Stop it. So, no, stop it. Was my little joke about, am I actually his lawyer? Dog, is that actually what happened, dog? He, like, moved to the fucking most predator-dense neighborhood in all of America. And it was even a bit much for Glory Hole Jerry. And he was just, like, naming fucking Golf Cart Matt because Golf Cart Matt is, like, the mascot of Pedophile Park. What? is this kids in the neighborhood wait so jerry who was just arrested for showing up here to have sex with a 14 year old boy tells your detective that he's glad we're here because this is this crazy place is filled with predators that's what he told him yes yeah. what do you make of that i mean you can't make this stuff up right so that's telling me that we're here we're in the right spot what are they gonna do a good thing to get these people off the street Dude, okay, this is actually crazy. This is a big problem now because you've caught two predators in one day that live in the area that know of each other. You're not going to be able to keep catching the neighborhood predators by bringing them to your house. They're going to have to start. I really hope that they're taking this really seriously. While in custody, he's seen by EMT. And that tattoo looks gnarly, dog. His complaints of pain. And not surprisingly, they find no serious injuries. And Jerry decides to tell the detective about his concerns about one of his neighbors. So tell me more about, you said, I know you mentioned something about there's other people in the park. What, what do you know about these other people? I know the guy with the green golf purse. Great the end, there's other... Do you know his name? Can you describe that for me? Does he live around you? He does. To so some people that he's in his 40s. Other people he says he's 30. I know that he hit me up on Grinder and he said he was 30. It is Grinder that they're using, so Maddie is finding victims via location based and he's the predator math. But he looks like he's in his late forties. Um, Honestly, Maddie doesn't look that old. I was thinking that he was like some scumbag in his like 20s or 30s. Have you ever met with him? No. Just freaked me out. And wow. This is crazy. Um, I see him because I have cameras on my trailer that watch things. And, yeah. Um, things. I see him. Rolling past all the time when the kids are out playing him, and I've always been cautious of him because of that. You know, like I've watched him. Jerry was charged with three felonies: child abuse of commercial activity, using a computer to commit a crime, and accosting a child for immoral purposes. All right, good luck, to you, Jerry. While golf cart Matt and Glory Hole Jerry weren't friends prior to meeting the Viper team and me, they've had. Plenty of time getting acquainted behind Bob. Now they, now they. I believe Jerry and Matt now are been introduced and they're sitting in the same cell together as we speak. So their name. What is this? This is so sick. Which again, 
Oh yeah, they're even closer than normal now. What must that conversation be? <laughs> Boy, to be a fly on the wall inside that gel cell. Yeah, why aren't you giving us the tea? What the fuck? Blue is the pre Okay, I'm not gonna do the advertisement. It's five dollars a month if you want access to Chris's channel, whatever. It's probably worth it, but hold on a second. It's, uh, I guess episode one slash 1.2 of what the fuck is going on in Michigan. Thanks for watching, and uh, if you're as curious as me, feel free to like do your own research and totally comment below and let me know what you guys think. If you have any theories about what's going on there, if you guys live in the area, especially if you live in the area, I want to talk to you. Um, but yeah, very, very interesting stuff here, guys. I was not expecting all that shit. I sat down to make a silly reaction to golf cart Maddie and glory old Jerry like four hours ago, and here I am. I haven't even started fucking going through the content yet. Now I've just got to basically... Shit, I've got, damn it, I literally now have like two, three, four hours of raw fucking video footage to edit and cut up for you guys. Thanks. Nah, but for real. <laughs>